FAXX is the upcoming sixth-generation fighter jet designed to replace the F-22 Raptor and F-35 Lightning IIS, the future leader of air dominance. Interestingly, while the U.S. Air Force has traditionally been the frontrunner in advanced aircraft development, it's the Navy that now appears most prepared to win the race toward the next-generation stealth platform. With increasing demands for better stealth, longer combat range, and more cost-efficient design compared to current models, the FAXX represents a bold new step into the future of aerial warfare. From the concept images released to the public, the aircraft adopts a blended wing body, BWB design with no vertical tail surfaces and approach meant to drastically reduce radar visibility. One of the most striking features of the FAXX is the absence of vertical stabilizers, which traditionally assist with yaw control in fighter jets. Instead, this new design relies on advanced aerodynamics and digital flight control systems to maintain high maneuverability without sacrificing stealth. The engine inlets appear fully recessed, a likely measure to reduce resonance that can be picked up by low-frequency radar. All of this suggests that the FAAXX is engineered from the ground up to be nearly invisible to enemy detection systems, especially in radar-contested environments. However, stealth alone isn't enough. The FAXX also needs to overcome several critical issues that current fifth-generation fighters face. For instance, aircraft like the F-35 still have noticeable radar signatures due to their angled vertical tails and large jet inlets, which can generate detectable sound patterns. Beyond design flaws, the F-35C variant costs approximately $117 million per unit, not including the GON.3 trillion in life cycle costs projected over a 66-year program. FAXX promises to correct these inefficiencies by offering a more streamlined, stealthier, and potentially more affordable aircraft without compromising on performance. The challenges the FAXX must overcome extend far beyond cost and stealth. Adversaries like China have developed highly capable area denial weapon systems designed to prevent any aircraft from entering contested regions. The DF-21D, for example, is known as the world's first carrier killer, capable of delivering a 600 kg payload over 2,150 kilometers. It has since been followed by the DF-26BE, which reportedly carries up to 18 cage and reaches distances of 4,000 kilometers. Even more alarming is the DFZF hypersonic glide vehicle, which can reach speeds of Mach 5 to Mach 10 and travel up to 1930 kilometers well within reach of key U.S. assets in the Pacific. Given such threats, the FAAXX must be capable of launching missions from a distance far enough to keep aircraft carriers outside enemy strike range. The F-35CE, for example, has a range of approximately 1,200 nautical miles with a combat radius of just 600 nautical miles, leaving it dangerously exposed if deployed too close to Chinese-controlled areas. The FAXX, in contrast, aims for a combat range exceeding 1,000 miles. This extended reach is essential for enabling safe carrier-based operations while maintaining the ability to strike deep within hostile territory. To achieve this kind of performance, the FAXX is expected to be powered by next-generation adaptive cycle engines rather than conventional turbofan engines like the F-135 used in the F-3045. Adaptive cycle engines, a CE can shift airflow dynamically to act as both a turbofan and a turbojet, optimizing for either fuel efficiency or high thrust, depending on mission demands. These engines are projected to propel the FAXX beyond Mach 2 and reach altitudes around 65,000 feet. While prototypes like the XA100 are still under development, they represent a major leap forward in propulsion technology and could redefine fighter performance. In addition to raw power and stealth, the FAXX will come equipped with a sophisticated suite of electronic warfare and sensor systems. Passive Infrared Search and Track, 
IRST technology will allow the aircraft to detect enemy heat signatures without emitting signals of its own. Furthermore, the FAXX will be capable of advanced electronic attacks such as radar jamming and signal disruption, while its sensor fusion systems will compile all battlefield data into a streamlined pilot interface. This will empower pilots to make faster, more accurate decisions in the heat of combat, even in complex threat environments. The most revolutionary feature of the FAXX is its integration with unmanned systems, specifically the Loyal Wingman or Collaborative Combat Aircraft, CC a concept. In this model, the FAAXX would operate alongside up to four autonomous drones, each assigned a specific role such as reconnaissance, decoy, electronic warfare, or defensive support. These drones would be partially AI-driven and capable of executing tasks without needing constant manual control from the pilot, allowing the main aircraft to concentrate on high-priority objectives while the drones manage threats and support functions. Picture a mission in which the FAXX ventures deep into enemy territory, deploying one drone to disable radar systems, another to guard the rear, and two more to act as flanking decoys all while the manned fighter zeroes in on a high-value target. With real-time data sharing and autonomous decision-making, this team could function as a miniature air force. The FAXX transforms from a single aircraft into a combat ecosystem using artificial intelligence and secure networking to execute multifaceted operations that would previously have required an entire squadron. With the Navy spearheading such an advanced project, questions naturally arise about what the Air Force is doing. The answer lies in the NGAD Next Generation Air Dominance program intended to deliver America's own sixth-generation air superiority fighter. However, the NGAD initiative has faced numerous setbacks, including redesigns and shifting requirements that have caused some major contractors, like Northrop Grumman, to withdraw. In contrast, the FFA-XX program continues to attract strong support and hasn't seen any major players back out. If both projects succeed, the Navy's FAXX may end up being more versatile taking on multiple roles beyond air superiority. Ultimately, the FAAXX is more than a jet. It's a glimpse into the future of war, one shaped by stealth, AI data, and innovation. Whether it ends global conflicts or simply escalates them into a new arms race remains to be seen.